We grow up thinking forests are the lungs of the earth. Huge trees, endless jungles, green continents. But the real oxygen factories, they're mostly tiny, drifting, almost invisible. All over the planet, in oceans, lakes and even damp soil, live microscopic organisms called phytoplankton, algae and photosynthetic bacteria. Each one is a single cell or just a thin thread of life. They use sunlight, water and carbon dioxide to make sugar and release oxygen as waste. Individually, they're weaker than a speck of dust. But there are trillions of them covering the sunlit surface of the seas like an invisible skin. Together, they're responsible for producing a huge share of the oxygen in Earth's atmosphere, at least as much as all the forests on land, and likely more. Every time a wave rolls, it stirs these tiny organisms, bringing them fresh nutrients. They bloom, die, sink, and are replaced by new generations in an endless cycle. You never see them, you never hear them, but they're constantly working, second by second, molecule by molecule, reshaping the air above the planet. So when you inhale, you're not just breathing forest air. You're breathing the silent work of invisible oceans. You're carrying the legacy of tiny cells that will never know you exist, but keep you alive anyway. Next time you stand by the sea, or even just look at a glass of water, ask yourself, how much of your life depends on worlds too small to notice? And as your lungs quietly rise and fall, remember that most of your oxygen comes from lives you will never see and never stop needing. Subscribe to keep on exploring our marvellous planet.